After a long two years of diapause or suspended animation, we finally have the first giant peacock moth emergence. These beauties are native to Europe and are the largest European silk moth with a wingspan of six to eight inches. The moth has some fame from appearing on one of Van Gogh's well-known paintings, although he did not know the species he was painting at the time and misnamed it the Death's Head Hawk Moth. Interestingly, the males of this species can be found flying both day and night, occasionally being mistaken for butterflies, while the females remain nocturnal, only flying at night. They dislike humidity and prefer a hot, dry environment to thrive, and typically choose host plants such as pear, rose, and Persian walnut, although they will eat several other types of tree leaves as well. There's only one single generation each year, so the adult moths have a heavy responsibility to find a mate and lay eggs during the week or two they survive to secure the next year's moths. As like most silk moths, they have no functional mouth parts to eat, so they are living off body fat to make it to the end of their adult journey. This moth is a female, and you can tell by her thinner antennae and thick body. The antennae are much more fan-like on the males, and once you see it, you won't soon forget. Hopefully, we will have a male emerge soon, so she will have a chance to reproduce. I have two others here that are ready to emerge at any moment. In the meantime, look at the incredible beauty of these fur-like scales with their intricate zigzags and stripes mixed with mauve, cinnamon, and brown coloration, as well as the eye spot present on all four wings, giving it the peacock moth name. 